How to build a water turbine when the grid is gone, the lights are dead, and your neighbors are cooking rats over a barrel fire. The cities are silent, your phones are paperweight, and the last working generator was stolen by guys with crossbows. You need power, not for Netflix, but for, you know, charging a flashlight so the mutants don't eat you in the dark. Solution? We hijack the river. Find a busted bike wheel, or better yet, steal one from the abandoned Walmart's kids section. Strip the rubber, slap on makeshift paddles, old metal spoons, bent license plates, anything that catches water. Shove that Frankenstein wheel into a stream so the current spins it like a hamster on meth. Now, tie the axle to an old alternator ripped out of a car you borrowed. Jam some wires on there with tape, gum, or your last shred of dignity. Water spins wheel, wheel spins alternator, alternator spits out volts. If you don't shock yourself, congrats, you're ahead of the curve. That's hydropower, baby. Kinetic energy to mechanical to electrical. The river doesn't sleep, so neither does your power. It won't run a fridge, but it might keep a radio alive. And when that radio crackles, it's either help or it's more bad news. Either way, hey, at least the turbine works. <laughs>